Hey, hi, good morning traders. This is Pratibad. This is 28 March 2017. It's about 7.55 a.m. Okay, this video for today's uh, trading ideas and for the whole week. Okay, first let's start with Euro USD. Okay, Euro USD on a daily chart. It's a very clear. Um, overall, it's a downtrend. You see, market have created a low, a lower high, lower low, lower high. So from that perspective, it is a very clear downtrend. And in fact, if you look look at from this point, is it? It's a downtrend. Okay, and those who like have learned the price action. This is the key line. So now market have attempt to break, fail, attempt to break, fail, penetrated, retest, try to retest again, try to retest again. So a lot of buyers are trying to break the 1.08667 level. So there's a good rejection taking place here. And if you, this is on a weekly chart. If you focus on a daily chart, the same scenario is taking place here. Market tried to break, fail, penetrated, retest, fail, retest, fail. Again, try to retest, fail. A lot of sellers are coming here. So, if you ask me, this is a very good uh, trade setup. What I'll do is I'll see, um, but this is a counter trade. So, I'll take a position here and place my stop loss here. And we'll try to grow my trade as, as as much as possible on the downside. Okay, but I'll uh, give a alert on this trade. Looking back on GBP USD, hmm, at the moment I, I won't take any position, but I'll be waiting at this area to go short. Once market reach this level, I'll go short. Or if market penetrate higher, I'll wait here at the retest to buy and go higher. Because the the Brexit gap since Brexit, okay, let me show you the thing. This break Brexit has a skinny leg here, which I haven't covered yet. Okay, and market will up. Uh, like another one or two years time either it's going to trade in a range or it will break higher retest you can buy here keep your trade as um, you know as it progress higher you can keep the trade up to 1.38 so that's going to be like what thousand pips okay this is on a longer time frame so at the moment i'm going to wait here to go short because this is a very good trading uh, range trading is it range you can go short close the position here buy close the position here okay and USD cat not so uh, clear price action story but what <coughs> it had established is a very good range so we can go short anywhere here okay and close the position at the 50% of the range. Euro yen <coughs> forming a triangle here. And what was the meaning of this? Okay. The liquidity is compressing. You see? So what will happen is there are chances for the market to uh, break higher and lower so what we'll do is wait until the market penetrate retest over here buy so what anticipation we can uh, learn here is it's going to move about thousand pips either north or south so you can wait for the position to break here retest and then go higher or penetrate down retest and then it's going to go down so please do uh, keep an eye on euro yen on a daily chart it might take another one or two weeks but this is very certain move okay Aussie cat I think last week video we saw this is a very good resistance 
we anticipated a lot of sellers to come in here yes sellers came and retesting here so but if you look from buyers point of view this is a high low high low high low high low a lot of buyers entering so what you guys can do now is buy now this is a live trade you can buy now stop loss at this level you can keep your trade up to this level and see if the market really penetrate higher or not if you see a rejection you should close your trade and this is about it's about 40 pips so this is a very good trade Aussie cat you can take a position now Aussie Swiss franc um, okay this is a very clear price action story I, I just uh, impressed with this chart see it is a very clean chart market try to penetrate fail try to penetrate fail penetrated retest stuck uh, stuck in the, this range and again it penetrated retest is it penetrate retest it advance and then this advancement become penetration retest advance so again it try to penetrate fail this is a false movement break retest stuck in a range penetrating again and retesting so it's a very clear price action story so what you guys can do on the price action traders on the lower time frame i as a price action trader i'll be waiting at this zone 0 0.75916 because a lot of sellers try to break this level fail try to break fail penetrated retest drop so they will come again to this point so what you guys can do is you can wait at this zone or you bring the price to us okay but counter trend is a bit risky but I always trade with, with the trend this is Aussie Swiss bank euro New Zealand dollar this is a skinny leg setup if you ask me there's an opportunity of wow 350 pips uh, this should be the highlight 350 pips 350 pips uh, profit okay 350 pips so what uh, does, there are two possibilities if market quit higher high and pull back so the skirt will be remain here but if, if at all the skirt I mean the market move higher like this and then create another high our new high going to be here our skirt will be here so the buyer zone will be shrinking and the seller zone will be expanding this is a great opportunity because the, our our pips capture will be like close to 500 pips so now what happening in the market is uh, it's just hovering here if at all the market drop below here and retest you can sell here, place a stop loss here, take profit here. This is 350 pips profit. Okay. Please focus, uh, those are intermediate students, please focus on Euro New Zealand dollar. Okay, gold. Gold established a very clear price action, sorry. Market tried to break, fail, penetrated, retest. And again, it's trying to retest. A lot of sellers entered over here. So what I'm anticipating is, okay, what I'm anticipating here, there's no clear confirmation that uh, bankers have entered here, but a lot of rejections taking place here, a lot of sellers coming in. I'll just keep an eye on gold, probably lower time frame. Yeah, lower time frame. Just, uh, I'll be observing on lower time frame. If I see any setup or confirmation, I'll just go short. There are two possibilities for gold, like what I mentioned earlier. It either it break and come, I mean, uh, reach one thousand two hundred twenty, or break higher, retest, and move higher. So this is a very critical area, thousand two hundred fifty. Just keep an eye on gold. Canadian Swiss franc not so good. Okay. Aussie New Zealand dollar 
if you guys see my video about two weeks back we said uh, it's already over here it will reach this point okay now if you ask me this is a very good area to go long buy sometimes we won't get the price because buyers feel that uh, this, this price is cheap enough they just bring higher so now in in a FIBO point of view because a lot of traders are using this it is at the 50% to 61% uh, range or area so a lot of buyers entering the market but if you ask me I will wait for the market to react at this level 1.07374 then I'll go along but I am anticipating I might miss the opportunity because uh, a lot of buyers already start entering here itself why buyers enter here you see high low high low high low this is higher high higher high higher high low 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 actually low low higher low higher low higher high higher low higher high higher low so it's very clear uh, price action story so a lot of buyers will be entering here so those who are like you know uh, can all monitor in a lower time frame like one hour or h4 so you guys can trade this chart this this pair okay but i'll be waiting only at this area the profit potential but 200 pips on this in this pair mm. Aussie-Yen beautiful uh, key line where market try to break fail penetrate and retest try to penetrate fail try to penetrate fail so uh, for sure market gonna retest to 85.42 I'll go short at this area or slightly higher so I'm, I'm giving the chart on observation or yen and Canadian yen if you ask me uh, among all the charts this is a great price action story story okay why a beautiful uh, price action uh, reaction over here is it Market try to penetrate higher, fail, try to penetrate higher, fail. Bias defending this price. Again, they try to bring higher, fail. Bias defending this price perfectly at the same price, 84.745. And then so buyers try to break higher, sellers defending this price. They push it down, fail. Then sellers massively entering, break, retest, drop. So what I'm anticipating over here, there are two areas for the market to react. I wouldn't buy or sell at this point, but I'll wait at this area, 84.74. This is a very good selling price. All the bankers, fund managers will be waiting at this area, at this key line. So just keep an eye on this chart. Probably we might take another two weeks or a month. On, on this pair okay uh, USD sing dollar this is a lower uh, low time frame trading opportunity if market retests this level with a confirmation I'll go short if there's no confirmation there's a uh, breakout on the upper side then I'll just wait for retest to go long okay but you need confirmation on this chart okay New Zealand dollar Last week we took a trade here, and then mark we made we close our profit here, so we did not stuck in this range of it. So now what I'm going to do is I'll wait. I'm waiting at this area, okay. So those traders who bought over here and stop loss here, they already break even. So whatever the market doing in range, they are not being affected. If you see on a lower time frame, H four. Market have created high, low, high, low, high, low. So it's very clear higher, high, higher, low, higher, high, higher, low. A lot of buyers already entered the market. 
and they having uh, some diffi- uh, tough time breaking above 0.70570 or 0.7685 so just need to observe if it break higher then its uptrend is continues and it will confirm hit 7130 0.7130 okay and then New Zealand yen again um, I'm still waiting at this zone as a price action trader a lot of traders are waiting at this zone to go short but the open market did not react here so now I'm waiting at this zone 79.22 if market reach this area a lot of sellers will be entering but with the confirmation you got to see because there are few traders are waiting here too so there's a chance for the market to reach higher at this point that means yen is going to weaken and gbp um, audi let me see it's a very clean uh, price action story this is a key level market reacted a lot of sellers entered on the lower time frame what i'm anticipating is market can pull back up to this level and then will attempt again gb body okay so you got to see the reaction of here either it's going to penetrate higher or reject it and drop so this is quite clean price action sorry and usd thai but i think my price action traders have requested me to discuss this if you see usd thai but since uh, 2015 May, it had advanced 4,000 pips. So now what we see in this op- opportunity, it's quite good skinny leg here, good skinny leg here. Um, um, you can't be focusing on weekly chart because it might take another one year for us to execute the trade. This is a very good area where a lot of sellers are waiting here at 34.82. So you can go short with a confirmation. Market will continue downtrend. And if you ask me, this is going to be like a, like what? Uh, 500 pips. This is a very good. And let's see the spread on this. The spread is... 200 pips wow 20 pips sorry this is 20 pips because you see this currency pair got seven digits so the last digit assume the last digit ignore because it's very small they say they have last digit this is 7.9 pips 27.9 27.9 27 ah it's about 20 pips uh spread okay this is a very good trading opportunity Okay, guys, trade safe. Good luck. And if you guys have any questions, please do post in the group. I'll reply. Thank you.